Welcome back to World of Warcraft, Wrath of the Lich King, Classic Blind. I'm a warg, being haunted by a ghost. Just normal things happening out here, in the Rivenwood. We've got two quests on our list. One to go to Scorn, and one to find... A bird. Town Shrike. A nest at the base of the waterfall, southwest of Scorn. So, both are going to Scorn. That works out perfectly. But first, cobalt mining. And mining, 430. The ward disguise gives a 80% movement speed boost, which is less than the swift ram, but you get to be a wolf, so I'm going to count that as a win here. Let's get through the woods here, get back on the actual road, and get to where we're going. I doubt we'll be able to keep this afterwards, and that is unfortunate. But that's what it is. We will, we will get our use out of it while we have it. Check the map here, we just keep following this road, and we should be getting where we need to be. Through the Howling Fjord. Past the West Spear Tower. And the sign does not actually say about Scorn. But I think it's just because it's a enemy camp kind of place. And those don't really have signposts as much. If I did not have this ability to see where ores are on the map would make this a lot more difficult. Worth it. Flowers or something. Right. So once we cross over this bridge, we'll be right where we need to be. That's it, right over there probably. Beautiful. We've got Winter Scorn Woodsman. Yep, here's Scorn. And that is Explore Howling Fjord. Beautiful. Okay. So from here, we can get a look at what we got going on here. We got flying guys. And call this guy in. He's seeing double of himself. I'm sure that's fine. Great to meet you. Here assist you and defend you. Your orders? Operation Scornful Wrath. Pleasure to meet you, sir. Look forward to working with you. Speaking of which, we have a great deal to do. Wow, three different quests. Towers of Certain Doom. So as we move through Scorn, we have to bring down those towers. If you look at them, you'll notice that the tops are lined with casters. Being too close to them would mean Certain Doom for us. However, we do have it within our means to call in cannon volleys from Westguard Keep. Do so when you get close enough you can lob a smoke flare atop of them. Just don't get too close. You need to lob some flares. See you soon. Top stuff. Okay. No. Gruesome but necessary. We've had reports that these Vrykel can raise from the dead. Not unlike the Scourge, but a different kind of undeath. Let's not take any chances. Here, take my machete. As we move through this place, we'll need to carve up the remains of the Vrykel that we take down. I do it, I have a sensitive stomach. Oh, sure. The sergeant smirks. I spent all morning sharpening it, so it should do the job. Use the machete to dismember 20 Vrakul. My goodness. What can I do for you? And burn, scorn, burn. Captain Adams gave me strict instructions to make sure that a good deal of infrastructure damage was inflicted on this site. However, since you're in charge out here, that's at your discretion, sir. May suggest that we burn down the two longhouses and the barracks that are 
in the lower area of Scorn. All we have to do is get inside each and throw this torch. Burn it all down. Keep your feet on the ground. Wild. What's on your mind? Can I have your spyglass? Of course. Be good. Set the longhouse and barracks ablaze from within. That's the torch. Here's a spyglass. Observe far off things from a distance. Yep, that's definitely... Hi, I can see you. <laughs> Alright. And it just lasts a while. Interesting. Okay. Well, I think we are ready to go. Let's go make a nice big mess of things. Shall we? We also have these two guys. Look what's come to play. It's us. Who's come to play? How are you? We're gonna get See you soon. a little bit in the way. <laughs> so we can click the quest on all of them. There's one berserkers. And this guy. Yeah, they are. They're not coming back from that. That's for sure. My goodness. Inside here. See if we can light this area on fire. Northern Longhouse set ablaze. Oh, yeah, it's very on fire. Let's see if we can find. Where we want to. There's the towers. Your entrails make a fine neck in some way. Well, I don't think we're gonna have very much luck with that. Luckily. Boy, we're just we're just cutting them all up. My goodness. <laughs> when they're made, when we tear them apart, they become meat. That's wild. Okay. We got the middle here. Let's get inside here. Track some. Yeah, this guy. Also gone. This is on fire now. Beautiful. Let's get out of here before we just die constantly. Doing a very good job with dismembering them. So that's working out. Where we get there? Vicol's Scroll of Ascension. A painted dragon skin depicting a mysterious Vicol ritual. Let's see what this is. Stop the Ascension. This huge scroll is made from dragon skin, unfurling its more than 10 foot length. See the images painted upon its scaly surface depict a mysterious Vicol ritual. Vicol Thane, surrounded by angelic looking beings, ascends into the heavens. A mysterious, darkened figure looms large in the picture's background. A tingling in your gut tells you the Thane of Scorn is about to do this. You must stop it. A large pyre sits atop the top of Scorn in front of the Thane's lodge. Present the scroll ascension near the Thane's pyre to call him out and slay him. Afterward, do the nation ritual. Be sure your father, Lemuriel, and Westgar Keep will be interested in seeing the scroll. So we are going to stop the ritual and then tell people about it. 
Oh, wait, look at, look at this place. Yeah, look at, look at all those mages up there. My goodness. Now well, let's throw flare over at the tower. Northwest tower targeted. Look at all the oracles up there. And they're all dead. Beautiful. Can we turn in one of the quests? Crucible necessary. Well, sir. And that's his. That's his. We can probably just finish all the quests and then worry about that. Technically, we don't really need to fight any more of these guys. Since we already. have turned them all into meat. <laughs> and to be fair, they're just going to. Respawn, anyways, no matter what we do. It doesn't make a huge difference. And you. Get a hood here. And. Torch this area. Beautiful. That completes that. Now we just need to target the southwest and southeast towers. Just going to wander through here. They seem to be practicing fighting. We're not going to worry about that too much. We probably should not try to get closer to the towers either. Since the whole... Tons and tons of mages. Just avoid these guys, maybe. They've got a warp, too. And we got an elder. He's dead. Got some shoulder pads. All the mages up there are dead. <laughs> Rune casters galore. Not a big deal. I wonder if we're gonna be making through here. Let's just fight this guy. Alright. Go a little quicker. Up to the final tower here. Throw the torch. Or fight these guys first and then throw the torch. That's fine too. Yeah, we're getting blasted. Sergeant Flay. And they all exploded. Very rude. turn in all the quests of this guy. Probably fine either way. Let's get up to the top here. And stop the ritual and all that. Here's the higher. Out here. Spell at the pyre. We could probably, probably be smart to clear out more guys first, but I think this is fine. Please, you know not what you're trying to do. I think I haven't been watching you. You're not so ascension time to work. Time to die. Vrykal observers. How unfortunate, Halfdan. Oh, he's just, just a spirit. So. We find you unworthy of ascension, half dead. Let your soul know oblivion. Oh boy. It is up there. Oblivioning. Alright. I think that's probably fine. Well, let us talk with our what can I do? sergeants here. 
Towers of Certain Doom. Those those towers of certain death. As long as the caster's right there. Yeah, sure. Keep your feet on the ground. We don't do the towers. Southeast tower. I guess we didn't do the southeast. How tower. are you? Right, southeast tower. Gotta go to the southeast. I think this might be the southeast tower. There we go. Southeast tower targeted. And all the mages. Explode. <laughs> Amazing. Let's turn all these in. What's on your mind? Towers of certain doom. Excellent targeting, sir. I'm to remember to buy a round for the cannoners back at the keep. This is all coming from West Guard Keep, I said, huh? That's a decent distance. What can I do for you? Complete the towers quest. Gruesome but necessary. Well, sir, I have to say that you went about that particular business with a bit of zeal. Sergeant looks at you warily. Anyway, if you don't mind, I'll be taking my machete back now. It looks dull, and we don't want you to accidentally slip and carve me up too. Fair. And burn, scorn, burn. Very good, sir. That couldn't have been done without your help. I'm sure the captain will be pleased with my report on the matter once we're done here. All hail the conqueror of scorn. We? Well, you. I've done everything that we were sent here to accomplish, sir. I must say, that it's been a pleasure taking orders from such a fine young dwarf. The captain is sure to want to hear of your success. If you decide to stay out here for whatever reason, I am at your disposal. Return to Westgard. Return the Westgard Command Insignia to Captain Adams at Westgard Keep. Alright. See you soon. So we're heading back to Westgard Keep. But first we have Eyes of the Eagle. Talent Shrike. At the base of the waterfall, just to the southwest of Scorn. Alright. The waterfall, southwest of Scorn, you say. I think we can do that. And then the other two are heading back to Westgard. These mages attacking. The mages are attacking. Not too worried about it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely something you want to avoid if possible. Alright. Downwards. If we can do this safely, that'd be great. Go into the water. Beautiful. There's Talon Shriek. You find the next. We're jumping off another cliff here. Find this nest. Oh, we've fallen. And we lived. <laughs> Surprisingly. There's a the nest. Oh. The water here is too shallow <laughs> for our shenanigans. Well. <laughs> look look how shallow this is right here. That's ridiculous. Much more shallow than it appeared. Ouch. <laughs> Let's have. Where is our. Press the There we go. Alright, build up. <laughs> Good to go. <laughs> Everything's fine. Let's go mess with this nest and get a bird to attack us. Touch. Disturbing. <laughs> We're disturbing the nest. Here's Town Street. He's attacked. Something like that. <laughs> Eyes of the Eagle. <laughs> Got it. Fantastic. We should be able to get out of here with this very convenient path here. Very nice. There's a broken bridge over there. This is the bit of a mess heading over to Chasm for the crazy explorers. I think we'll start by heading to Steelgate 
and then loop back around to West Guard. I mean, don't need to go to Steel again, actually. We need to go to. We need to go to. Whole thing. That is this way. Let's try to not go through the ribbon wood this time. With all the spiders and nonsense. Took a one damage fall from something. Wild. Exactly how fall damage works is a question. Whether it's linear, exponential. There's certain falls that don't do any damage, but eventually. Eventually just die immediately. <laughs> really thought we were gonna be fine jumping into the river. Didn't work out. Alright. So you get up here. So the spyglass. Country item disappears if logged out for more than 15 minutes. Wild. How? Peculiar. Not that we really need a spyglass. That's okay. And we'll switch back into wolf form here. Yeah. Very smart. Warg disguise. Friendly with the Fingor Warg pack. Very useful. Not friendly with the giant spiders that are larger than an entire wolf, but not gonna worry about that. Not gonna worry about that at all. And there is ore right here. Uh, gonna go for it. It's a dangerous idea being right next to all these guys. For a cobalt deposit, I'll take it. Eyes of the Eagle. You have the Eyes of the Eagle. Though dead, the eyes seemingly look right through you. Yes, I do. Well, thing howls loudly, and your defeat of his great eagle enemy. The honor of the kill is yours. Wish that had been my maw to finally close upon her neck. Let's not waste the sacrifice that she has made for us. Here, eat them. Alpha Warg. When you've eaten Talon Shrike's eyes, you should be able to, you should be able to see Garwal and rip out his throat. Dwarf thing, seek out and slay Garwal in the Western Ribbonwood. After you have killed him, go and tell Moonleaf that I am once more the Alpha Warg. As you slay Garwal, then turn to Warg, Warg's disguise to watch for Moonleaf at Steel Gates. So it seems the old thing knows that we are a dwarf in some description. Interesting. Well, let's get away from the wargs here before we try doing this. What do we got here? We need to find Garwal. Even the eyes should be able to see Garwal. Okay. Do I have eyes to eat? Able to see Garwal. Okay. Where are they going to be at? In the Western Ribbonwood. Alright. Well, this is definitely the Western Ribbonwood. Kinda. Let's go south. Not over to where the grass is a different color. Oh, here he is. There. Are. This is what Garwall is. They're skinnable, which is definitely something. Oh, there they are. <laughs> They're dead again. <laughs> There's two dead garwalls. We're just waiting for a, another garwall to show up. <laughs> this does raise some questions, but I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> if only we could fight them in warg form. That'd be something. <laughs> Garwall. Eh, 
there are just some points where you're just kind of waiting around. Maybe they were twins. That would definitely be helpful to spread your influence throughout the ward pack. I mean, multiple of yourself, basically. Apparently they were invisible, which is also something. I expected them to have, like, a cave that they had enchanted to make it impossible for us to see through without the eyes. Not the case, apparently, as far as we can tell. It's just a war, it's a spider. Well, I guess we just went around here for a little bit. Enjoy the line right here where it switches to a different grass type and a different area. Because you're right on the edge of Grizzly Hills here. There's Dun Argyll. That's, that's a place. Unlocked a lot of that map just by existing around here. Oh, he was a wolf kind of guy. Enough of this charade. Whack. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> Alright. Well, so much for that, then. <laughs> Goodbye, the Garwal triplets. That makes a lot of sense. Don't fight me now. Alright. There you go. Back to Steelgate and Westguard. Kind of in costume. I'd say it still counts. Yeah. Still, I'd still count that as War Guy. No respect here. No respect. Out of here. Joel. 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 Right there. He's back. Should probably go around this area. Can you mess with that right now? And back to Steelgate. Like there was a river here, it was kind of dried up. Probably because of the excavation here at Steelgate. And all the water was flowing down into there instead. Right? Alpha of work. Have you you've returned? What news of all thing? Garwal was not a warg at all. <laughs> she she doesn't agree too much. The thing you described him turning into sounds a lot like a worgen. Wolfang said that it came south from Grizzly Hills. Odd. There aren't any warg in there. Thank you for helping to restore Wolfang to his proper place among his back. Now we both will be able to sleep peacefully. Please you must accept this as a sign as a sign of gratitude. Got some cloth pants, some male feet with spell power, a plate with strength, stamina, and expertise. Not bad. got less strength, more stamina, no critical strike, no agility. Does have expertise now. That's interesting at least. 42 stamina chest. How's that compared to ours? 48. Strength, stamina, defense rate. That's probably still better for the tanking though. And expertise is definitely interesting. Not too, not too necessary. Oh, we'll just take it, because it's the most expensive one. We got another crystallized earth here. Filling up everything. Alright, perfect. And we could do the daily quest there, if we wanted to. Don't really need to. So instead we'll just head back to Westgard. By going south. 
west south. Something, something. Anyways. Pop over this bridge here, over Whisper Gulch. Yeah, let's get into town here. We got the walls that you can just go around. It's definitely a decision. West guard keep. And everybody's upstairs. Perfect. Alright. Let's turn these in. With Captain Adams. You got my attention. I'll hail the Conqueror of Scorn. I gather that since you're here, Scorn is no more. Yeah. We cut everyone apart and burned everything to the ground. So, yeah. <laughs> That's unbelievably good news. I knew that you could pull it off, Eric Jackson. At least someone around here can produce results. Well, this calls for a reward. Go ahead, take your pick. The treasury is open to you. Got some male feet with intellect. Mm. Honestly, not too bad compared to ours. We lose some stamina, but we gain attack power and critical strike rate. So technically, these are better. Technically, they're better. But they also have way less armor, so I think that would probably cancel out the tiny upgrades anyway, so meh. Got armor penetration, strength, and stamina plate here. Okay. So we lose some hit rating, but get more armor penetration. We lose... We lose more critical strike and attack power than we gain back in strength. I don't think those are necessarily better. They do have more armor, though. That's something to consider. All these things... Plate. Plate, 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 plate. Plate, plate. Plate, plate, plate. This is plate with 19 stamina on the wrist. It says 45 stamina. My goodness. Uh, it's got more armor. But less attack power. Less critical strike rating. Here's a necklace. Spell power. No. Attack power, stamina, and agility. Leather chest plate. Again, just not quite enough attack power to offset the strength of a current piece of equipment. So. Nah. And we have another quest here. Dealing with Jellybron. My humble appreciation. And now we have a different problem. My scouts have lived to return. I've informed me that the Vrykul are up to no good at their main fortress to the north. They call the place Jellybron. Though you pronounce the G J as if it were an, if it, as if it were a sh. So Jellybron. Odd features. Well, that's not important. What is, is that you get up there and put an end to the lives of as many of those creatures as you can while trying to figure out what they're up to. No, we can, we can count on you. Okay. To Shalabron. And fight a whole bunch of guys. Watch, get her back. And do that. And also talk to him. Help. Stop the ascension. Yes? How do I help you, my child? We got this ten foot long dragon skin ritual thing. Yes, my son, that is ominous looking, and you obviously had the right of it. Thank you for bringing this scroll to me. I'm very keen to study its implications. If I were to hazard a guess, I said these Vrykul have a way to transcend death, at least those that are worthy. By defeating the Winter Scorn Thane, you proved him unworthy. The light only knows what he would have become, what Tarek he might have rained down upon us, had you not slain him. Got some very magical shoes. Spell power, man restore, shoulders. Some plate armor here, which can be used by many races. Strength, critical strike, and armor penetration. Can we lose? The critical strike is about as good as the agility. So we lose the strength, stamina, and hit rating for the armor penetration rating. And it has less total armor, too. 
or a leather spell power thing. Yeah. Armor penetration or hit rating. They're both fine. Let's take the most expensive thing. Up the keys and cages. The captain may not care. From the little we know, the Vrykul are conducting heinous rites in some sort of awakening ritual up north in Shalaron, using living sacrifices to fuel their unholy rituals. Oh no. Warrior, you? Let's put a stop to this. It matters not who or what is in those cages. They must be freed. I bet that the Vrykul hold the keys. The light knows that the last thing we need is more of those strange Vrykul walking about, or worse yet, yeah, them waking something even more evil. Free ten... Shadowbrown prisoners. Go with honor, well, we were heading that way anyways, so... Perfect. That works very nicely. Alright. Let's get over there. I had a feeling we were going to do some stuff up there. Since we saw it was an entire place we hadn't been to before. Head up to the north. Alright. There's a whole other pile of cobalt. Goodness. Anything in here we want to keep? We've got our boxes. We've got boxes for days. Here's another whole pile of cobalt. My goodness. Um, gray, gray, gray. Spell power, gray, 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 gray. Gray, gray, spell power. Gray, 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 gray. Expertise. I think we're still good on hit rating for now. Expertise is definitely something, though. I can only, I can only press to go right right now, based on the buttons I'm holding. Probably fine. This one has. This one's leather. This one's male. I think I'm good too. Oh, there's something in this guy. They sound level 71 undead elite. And a warrior running that way. Alright, here we go. Shall I run? Let's get it on. This soul's attacking me. I don't think that counts. Alright. We need to fight warriors, and runecasters, and sleep watchers. Oh, there's some attack plants. Tailing plants of attack upon Westgard Keep by Glacian the Frostworm. And do an imminent attack upon Westgard Keep, appear the Frostworm Glacian, whose circles overhead is to be used for the offense. Surely a master would be of some assistance to this matter. Your plans to him to keep to the south. Deliver this to Westgar Keep. Alright, we will do that later. For now, we are attacking here. Yeah. And there's a cage key. Perfect. So we can start working towards unlocking 10 cages. There will be no everlasting life for you. Or you, for that matter. That's none of my business. Oh, thank you, thank you. Key. Beautiful. Just letting the prisoners free. Beautiful. Right, let's try heading further up into here. Let's see what there is to see. We got putrid rites, deathless watchers. Too far away. Quite the mess. That's a frostbolt. Deathless Watcher. 
not gonna, not gonna be deathless for long, I'm afraid. Give these guys a whole spin. What's down in here? Fearsome horrors. Sorts of crazy stuff. The two will serve the Lich King. Free them. My thanks to you, hero. Is it freed? Look at this putrid right. That's a whole business down in there. Any more keys? Not currently. Okay, well, these guys. We definitely have a lot of scourge and such going on here. Oh, we angered these guys. That's fine. Out of here. You're not our targets. This seems to be a way into there exactly. That's okay. Let's get back further into here. He's gonna eat my heart. Appreciate it if you didn't, honestly. Please don't. Okay. No hero to rescue me? Ask and you shall receive. Amazing. Target is dead. Not ready yet. Alright, how we doing? Oh, there's there's something. Special overseer elite. I'm sure that's fine. Warrior. I just love sprinting over to places. It's pretty great. Oh, he's coming down this way. Not a bad thing. Probably a bad thing. Got yeah, 37,000 health. Just weaken him. Give him a good thrashing. That's probably for a quest. <laughs> I'll worry about that later. Also like the giant dragon thirst probably for a quest. It's probably fine. Let's go up this way. We mostly need warriors. Like that one there. Village Scythe of the Wolf, a two-handed pole arm, 108 damage per second, agility, spirit. That's pretty cool. Always up for some two-handed weapons. Always exciting. Alright. Neat. That actually has a decent auction price. That might actually be worth looking into. These are Necrolords. You're gonna die, are we? I suppose. I don't think any of these are relevant for our quest, unfortunately. Um, there's a Necrolord there. There's a sleep watcher. Yeah. I need my heart. Hey, we. Hey, 
my keys. We do. That's eight prisoners free. Make our way over this way. This guy a good way. And you. Now we just need one more sleep watcher. And the rest warriors. At least for this specific quest. There's the overseer again. Probably fine. There's a warrior. Okay. good. Another warrior down. Let's go up to the top here. Let's see what we have to see here. More Necro Lords. What is in here? Eager to die, are we? I think you'll find you're the ones dying. Winter's Terrace. More Necro Lords. King Yimron. Level t question mark, question mark. There's more warriors in here, though. I'll take it. We're just here for the warriors. Your high level boss can. Shoot. Oh boy. Oh boy, what are they doing? Queen Agraboda. Alright. Well, she's dead. The Lich King's here. Hello, the Lich King. Yet, Yimaron, I have other plans for you. Oh boy. You will serve me better within Utgard Pinnacle. And if these insects survive to find you again, you will get the chance to avenge your wife. Oh, we killed his wife. Fantastic. Okay. So clearly mistakes have been made here. We just we just popped in here. We weren't even supposed to be coming up this high. We're just out here. Making choices. All of them terrible. I'm sure we're gonna be doing all that again. Once we get back here a second time. All right, now go deal with the Necro Lords and their boss and Nimron's wife. It's like, yeah, we already did that. Not gonna let us do it. Not again. Let's run away. All right. West guard. West guard. West guard. Perfect. They definitely have some deep. Prisons and magic and stuff going on. Nice flip. Or spinner. Whatever you call it. Get whacked by souls. Classic. Alright. Sprint back through the Rivenwood. Get back to Westgard. Turn all these in. Get the next set to go right back over there. It works. It works. Good jump. Leave him in the dust. When you make the jumps, it definitely helps. But still, more convenient would be flying. But we don't have that. We got a decent amount of money here. I'll have to check to see how much flying is going to cost, or what level we can actually get flying at. Because right now we could afford to get the dual spec, so we can do tanking stuff. Not that our current tanking 
one-handed weapon would actually be usable. Since it is a fist weapon, we have zero expertise, or whatever you want to call it. Proficiency, weapon skill. Fist weapon? Maybe on here. Fist weapon. <laughs> Unarmed, maybe? You need Either way. Something? The attack plans. What? Plans for an attack upon the keep? A frost worm? Yeah, it's pretty bad. <laughs> hey, Kirkson, we can't let this come to pass. I've toured the fjord. So, that is. The achievement worth of you've done all the quests. But we're not done. There's still things to do. Very interesting that you don't need to do all the quests, apparently. The Frost Worm and its master. You were right to bring this to me, Eric Harrison. You must take help back north with you to Shalibron and slay the Worm and its master, Worm Caller Vile. Even now, as we speak here, the Frost Worm may be on its way. However, if I'm reading these plans correctly, Blowing the worm caller's horn on this platform outside in the rear left area of Shalabron will call Lysion back when the creature lands to destroy it. Eric Erickson, please bring me back the horn. We wouldn't want it falling back into the wrong hands. Slay worm caller vile and call the worm back. See you. And defeat it. How are you? Dealing with Shalabron. Good work, Eric Erickson, and good riddance. What you say about the place troubles me still. I think our calling is not quite at an end. Necro Lord Mezen. The Scourge are at Jalaron, and they have necromancers with them. They must be working to bring the Vrykul into Arthas' fold. I want the leader of those Necro Lords eliminated. Do whatever it takes, Eric Erickson, but see to it that Necro Overlord Mezen, whatever he's attempted to accomplish, is neutralized. I would not see the Vrykul successfully allied with the Scourge. On the platform in the right rear section of Shelbron. Very good. And what can Father Memorial of Keys and Cages. Bless you, child. With your help, the light shines even in the darkest of places. Please take this as just compensation for your good deeds. I shall see to the salvation of those you freed, at least, those truly within the light. And the Alliance. And return who return here to the keep. Major Sam Elsewhere whispers have words to you. So this has been an exemplary, Eric Erickson. There is something that is troubling me. The Scourge. Now yeah, that's clear. Light cannot abide their presence, neither shall we. But it's not asking you too much. I would have you return north to Shelbron and crush the unholy Scourge in that vile lair. Be sure to check for them in the walking, waking halls beneath Shelbron as well. Pooch Purification is the key to salvation, my child. Make us proud. Be careful. Mage Lieutenant Malister, where are they? There he is. We got another quest for us. Wow. What can I do for you? Sleeping Giants. I've overheard what you've had to say with Father Lavoriel. Let me suggest that he's not having you go far enough. You must also deal with the Vrykul that lie dormant in the waking halls beneath Shalabron. I have no doubt that the rituals involved with awakening them are the key to their downfall. Most likely the Necrolords have some device that you can use to bring the Vrykul out of their dormant state prematurely. Surely such a disruption would prove fatal to the radical. Sounds like a plan. Just even think it's over. They pile even more quests on. Yeah. Ain't that, ain't that just how it be. So we have four more quests to do back over at Shalabron. And that is more than yeah, I can get this done in the next 10 minutes kind of deal. So, even though we've completed the achievement... We've completed the achievement. Summary? Yeah, here it is. We've completed it. I guess it's just not updating on the quest section here for some reason. This is the old number. Well, we've done it. We got the achievement. It's completed. There it is. Now it's completed. Weird. <laughs> but yeah. We've toured. We've toured. The Fjord. 
But we're not done yet. We'll be finishing this up. Probably. Who knows. But realistically, this is the last bit of the map we haven't done everything in, as far as I can tell. There's other areas that are horde-only kind of deals. So. This is probably going to be the end of things. Here in the Howling Fjord. Next time. Goodbye.